Good Wednesday morning. Hope you are doing well. A happy Canada Day to all. Uh, today, I would like to share with you a story about a donkey. He was a donkey that would communicate. He talked. And at the same time, he was very pessimistic, uh, gloomy, depressed. And I'm talking about Eeyore. If you are not familiar with Eeyore, so there's a character, a, a cartoon by, by the name of Winnie the Pooh. And the donkey in Winnie the Pooh, his name was Eeyore. And he wasn't happy, never satisfied, had issues with his tail, if I remember well from my childhood. A depressed donkey. Now, in this week's Parsha, we also have a story about a donkey. And the Torah tells us the donkey communicated like Eeyore. But it doesn't mention that the donkey was depressed. But I do think that a donkey that had to live its life with a Bilam is depressed. And let me tell you why. The world was created for a purpose. The purpose of the world is to go ahead and have a human being who recognizes the Almighty and fulfills the will of the Creator. When the person does his part, when the human being does his part, we are told we don't just elevate ourselves, we elevate the world. And as a result, believe it or not, there's sanctity. You use the computer for the right thing, there's sanctity in the computer. You have animals and you use them in the right way. You are elevating these animals. Unfortunate it is for a donkey to land up with a master like Bilam, Because the reality is he was not fulfilling his mission in existence. Bilam had great potential, right? He could have done incredible things. Instead, he thought about himself. So Nebach, his donkey, was a sad donkey. So therefore, I think I have good proof that Eeyore was perhaps even a Gilgal, perhaps a reincarnation of the soul of the donkey of Willem, because yes, depressed he was, and his communication did not elevate his spirits at all. A little message about the Parsha, but also a reminder of how we should view the world, and we should be optimistic and happy and see purpose in existence, because there is indeed a lot of meaning, and that should uplift our spirits. It should be a wonderful day. All the best. Bye-bye.